I'm Scott Vanderwall and I'm a farmer from Volga, South Dakota, where we raise corn and soybeans and have a beef cattle feedlot. This is a modern hybrid of corn that you're looking at right now. You can see it's a little bit ragged. That's because it was wet when we planted and we were a little bit delayed. But this is what's called a gen genetically modified organism, or GMO as some people like to call it. And you can see it's normal corn, just like anything else. The only difference is, is that it has a protein in it, a special protein, that's toxic, toxic to certain insects. It does not affect humans in any way, it does not affect animals in any way. The BT gene that's in this corn helps us control the insects that might attack the plants, so the plants are healthier and the product is therefore more nutritious for the animals. Or if there's a little bit of corn that's used in human food and a lot of it goes to ethanol. And the higher quality product we can produce, the better off we are. So anytime you hear about GMOs being bad or toxic to the environment or to people, think about this. This corn is natural. It's normal corn. It's just different for insects that might attack it. And it is safe. It's been proven safe many, many times. And we use it for production advantages and for the overall health of the product.